what's the smaller people in Lord of the Rings? Not elves. Hobbit. The hobbits, oh yeah, hobbit sized. Hobbit. These are hobbit sized. Hey, everybody. This is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited today because I haven't done any kind of birria taco challenge since actually when I was in Miami, Florida back in early 2021. But today, I am going for overall victory, number 1,193. I am still in the greater Auckland, New Zealand area on the North Island. I'm going for my second win in the Auckland area of this trip, but we are all here with big thanks to my friend Sean, who owns Broke Boy Taco. Uh, he right now is pretty much operating as a ghost kitchen or a pop-up actually inside Ponsonby Social Club uh, as part of the greater Auckland area. But I'm hoping to become the first person, Katina and I are both helping to kick off the Rich Boy Challenge. Now, he pretty much sells just one thing uh, and they look awesome. There's actually three of them uh, right here. He's got his own spin to a delicious looking birria taco. So uh, I do actually have to finish these three normal size ones that he serves pretty much, I think, every day uh, here right now at Ponsonby Social Club. But really, the big part of the challenge is the supersized ones. They are freaking huge. I've already tasted a little bit of each part. It's gonna be yummy, but I've only got 30 minutes to finish everything here. Now, there's pretty much, uh, of course, the taco uh, tortillas are over here, and then we've got burrito flour tortillas here. But they're all dipped in a red sauce or an oil, which is achiote. That all looked great, and then it is put on the grill along with a whole bunch of cheese. Now the cheeses for this are Colby and mozzarella. That's not the typical birria cheese, but the typical birria cheese is very expensive and hard to find here in Auckland, New Zealand. And then each of these has a whole bunch of Sean's beef chuck. And then of course there are healthy vegetables on each of these. There's a whole bunch of red onions and then cilantro. And then I've already tried this. This is making the challenge quite spicy, but it's not too bad. But this is Sean's orange sauce, which is pretty much a secret recipe, but yeah, let's just say it is spicy. So I've got 30 minutes to finish. If I fail, this entire challenge is gonna be 120 New Zealand dollars. Each of these is pretty much $40 each. Uh, and then the challenge, of course, includes these three here. If you come in normally for a normal platter, you get three tacos along with the consomme sauce for $22. So that is all right. I think these are quite large. So this is a pretty good deal for only 120. But if I do win, I'll get my entire meal for free. I will not get a sweet t-shirt, but I will be the very first person with my name and photo hanging up on the wall of fame of Broke Boy Taco. Sean's eventual goal is to get an actual brick and mortar restaurant. So once that is up and going, I'll have my name and photo hanging up in there. Let's get this challenge started. All right, Alice is ready to eat. Let's kick off his challenge and dominate. Uh, from what I've heard, these are gonna be good. So let's shut up and eat. One, two, three. Boom! All right, Katina's timer is going. Let's see what we can do about dipping one of these things, which, wow, uh, each of these is like a pound and a half to a pound and three quarters. Let's dip it in this consomme sauce and get eating. Oh, wow. Mm. You can definitely taste the flavor of not only the consomme and the uh, orange sauce, but that slow cooked uh, beef chop. That is yummy. Love all the cheese on here too. Yeah, Sean and uh, Broke Boy Taco, they've got uh, reels and stuff all over both Instagram and TikTok. Uh, we looked at those and knew we had to come here while in the Auckland area. And we, of course, as the proud Americans we are, we had to come support a proud uh, American himself, Mr. Uh, Sean from Kentucky trying to make a name for himself in Auckland, New Zealand. He's actually married to a Kiwi. Oh, which brought him here to start this business. 
All right, 415 in, we're done with one. Katina Ooh. had this idea, let's chase it with a normal sized one. Uh, as you can see, uh, these uh, bigger ones on the burrito tortillas are just a little bit bigger uh, than the common muggle uh, folk one here, but let's use the regular consomme and get this one down. We are in New Zealand, Lord of the Rings territory, so can't use Harry Potter stuff. What's the smaller people in Lord of the Rings? Not elves. Hobbits. The hobbits, oh yeah, hobbit sized. Hobbit. These are hobbit sized. I cannot believe I went to Hobbiton yesterday. <laughs> these are hobbit sized tacos. And these are for Atlas. And maybe you, if you think you can handle one. Let's do this one. I love how long uh, Sean cooked this thing on the grill as well. It's helping to make this uh, eat it easier. If you have the orange sauce by itself, it's very spicy, but mixed in with everything else, thankfully it's not too bad. Sean's been watching our videos for many years, so I appreciate that as well. Working my way, almost done with the second one. Second big one. Last bite of Big Taco number two. Ooh, there we go. Mm. Let's finish off the second small one. Two bites. Oh, we're gonna get it though. Don't want taco number two on the small one. There we go. All right, I am gonna do, we're 15 minutes in now, so halfway. Uh, I'm gonna do this third small taco just to get it done, and then focus on the Big Daddy uh, for the end. I think I'm making this up, but we're 17 minutes in. Let's just say we saved the smallest one to last. All downhill from here. Don't get 13 minutes to finish this thing. We're 1810 in. I don't want to uh, risk anything. This is my final food challenge as a 36 year old. Uh, filmed on Friday, June 23rd. I turn 37 tomorrow. So. We can't go out of 36 with a loss. We got to dominate this thing. Oh, we're standing now, we're gonna get it. I'm gonna make sure nothing fell in. Get a little sauce on these scraps. Eat this normally and then eat the, the rest of the taco. Big dunk? Big dunk? Yeah, yeah, I got it. All right, 2644. Nice. Ooh, and they brought me some apple juice from the bar. Awesome, thank you, Sean. Okay, that's gonna help, we got this. Yeah. 
I'm sitting down now. I cannot say that I am completely happy with that time, but a win is a win, and I am really proud that I was able to fight through those last 10 minutes and get that victory. Ooh, I had 30 minutes to finish. Ooh, this one was legit. It wasn't like two seconds to spare. 29 minutes and 56 seconds. <laughs> I've already said along the way how delicious and great I thought all of those tacos were. Uh, really, those were birria burritos, but they were served kind of like tacos and I was able to dip them in the consomme uh, like they were tacos because of the big bowl, which I really thought is cool because uh, it's got the branding, of course, for uh, Broke Boy Taco. For me, it was overall victory number 1,193. Uh, if you want to come in, even if you don't want to try this challenge, uh, just come on in. Uh, right now he's at Ponson Bay Social Club. So check out all of Sean's social media for Broke Boy Taco. He cooks pretty much 30 kilograms uh, every day that he is here. And since he started, he's never not sold out. So I know why they sell out now. Those were so good. So it's great to get here uh, to help him kick off his brand new challenge. I think we've got two more challenges coming up in the Auckland area. If you like this video, be sure to watch either this one or this one. Both videos filmed uh, previously here in Auckland but either way I'll catch you in the next video thanks so much for watching when before you begin